Hello, Internet land. This is Natasha here with another daily book review. And the book that I want to share with you today is called The Unemployed Millionaire. Escape the Rat Race, Fire Your Boss, and Live Life on Your Terms. And this was a great book that I found in the library and just, you know, perusing and discovering the new library where I moved to and found this book and thought, hmm, this is very interesting. Let me let me check this out. The Unemployed Millionaire, because we know that there are a lot of people who are online and, you know, want to be able to work from, from home. And there are a lot of online opportunities. So without having to be on the job. So definitely this was one book that piqued my interest. But one of the things that I like that he talked about in this particular book it was on um, chapter three and this is about you see that beliefs and what I love what he talked about is if you don't believe that you can be successful if you don't believe that you deserve to live the life of a millionaire for example then your actions will not lined up with it and I know this from my own example for a long time I was always trying to be um, an entrepreneur working on different businesses and what have you in the MLM community but I realize that now looking at it in hindsight that I really didn't believe I could do it because the messages around me in my environment, everyone was working a job. Yeah, I did that too, but I ultimately knew that I was destined for more than that. I wanted more than that. You know, in the, so the beliefs and the messages around me didn't reinforce what I was trying because no one else was doing that. And so, um, you know, reading this in this book and seeing this about the beliefs, your beliefs have to be strong enough in order for you to carry out the tasks that you want to do in order to be an unemployed millionaire if that's what you so chose to choose to do or if you want to be able to work from home because even though it is not a job per se you can still work it in terms of what you hope to accomplish for your family but if you don't believe that you can have it you won't do it um, one of the quotes he has in here is the only two limitations for your life are the limiting beliefs in your mind. And I know many of us have seen that before, that our beliefs are according to what we say. So even though I say my environment did not um, support my beliefs and what have you, it was still ultimately up to me to believe that I can do whatever it is I wanted to do in spite of what anybody else said. So with that, Though for those of you who are working to have a home-based business, and I know many of us are, you're not going to be able to do what you want to do and what you need to do if you don't increase your belief. And however you have to find a way to do that, do it. But your beliefs are the foundation of you being successful in any area of your life. So um, hope you, you know, get some value from that. And, you know, pick up this book if you can, The Unemployed Millionaire by Matt Morris. It's a great book. Still working on finishing it and what have you because I like to take my time with it but it's an awesome book. So if you want to connect with me click on one of the links below.